Hey guys, it's Trey here once again, and today I have some really good news. Um, I just got done building my new PC, so this computer will be used for editing videos, and pretty much that's really it. Um, so my video quality should improve, and among other things. So um, today, since I just built this computer, I need to add my programs that I'm going to be using. And as you all know, I love VS Code, so I will need to install VS Code on this machine, and I want to show you guys how to install it on Debian. So I'm running Debian Buster, uh, which is Debian 10, I believe, um, and it's a little more in depth to install VS Code on here because you have to add the repository, and it's not hard to do. It's just a couple of more steps that you need to do instead of just running the install command. All right, so I found a guide online on how to do this, so I'll post that in the description. I'll just be following this guide, and it's there to help you guys um, if you need to see it in text format. It has all the commands that we'll be running in it, and you can just go there and check it out. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. It says step one, we need to update the package index and install the dependencies. So what we're going to do is um, we're going to run sudo apt update. All right. All right, and we've done some updates. So now we're gonna run sudo app install. We're gonna say software dash property dash common. Then we're gonna say app dash transport dash HTTPS. And then we're also going to install curl. So I believe I already have these programs on here, yep. So next we're gonna put curl to work right away. We're going to install, no, no, we're going to import the Microsoft GPG key using the following curl command. So we're going to say curl, then we're going to do dash lowercase s, capital S, L, then HTTPS, forward slash slash, packages dot Microsoft, dot com slash keys slash microsoft dot asc and we're going to pipe this into a sudo apt key add with a dash all right and we got the okay which is what we were supposed to receive after that command Next up, step three, we need to add the Visual Studio Code repository. So we're going to do this by doing sudo add dash app dash repository. All right. And then here we're going to type in deb and then arch equals amd64. Then we're going to do HTTPS colon forward slash slash packages dot Microsoft dot com slash repo slash VS code stable main. So type all of that in and there we go. It's been added and now we can run the sudo app update command once again so we've added the repository now we're updating and adding on uh, updating that, that that list all right so now that we have that updated we can run sudo apt install code all right so it shows that I already have code installed but um, for you it would actually install uh, VS code right here and then once it's installed you can just type in code to make sure that everything is running it will pop up and once it comes up it came up on my other screen here so um, but it will come up and when it comes up then you know you've installed VS Code correctly um, that's all for this video thanks for watching like and subscribe to the channel and all that jazz and I will see you guys in the next video